Film accounting and auditing, intermediate level. Okay, so what is intermediate level? Let's have a look to see what the AICPA defines it as. And we've got intermediate. Learning activity level that builds on a basic program. So that's from our basic level. Most appropriate for CPAs with a detailed knowledge in an area. And the area we're talking about, of course, is film accounting and auditing. Such persons are often at a mid-level within the organization with operational and or supervisory responsibilities. So we're looking at a supervisor manager level here. So, okay, let's have a look at the learning objective that I've defined. The outcome, the participant will understand the interaction among the production entity, the approved budget, the production documents, call sheets, daily production reports, etc., and the final cost report, which is the document audited for film tax incentives. And from this understanding, the CPA will be able to plan the tax credit audit of the film or television production with greater certainty that all industry-specific factors in the state's audit instructions are understood and can be properly addressed. And this state's audit instructions are expanded upon the advanced level. Okay, so now how do I do that? So we've got it broken into four parts. First part here is the production entity and intellectual property rights. I thought you should understand something about the some legal aspects in the way the entity is treated. And part two, the film production. Again, the film production budget, I should say. It is the backbone of anything to do with finances. It's what we all approve. It's where we're coming from. Um, and I did mention here that uh, there's a video after the uh, introductory page and the video is just conversational style. And one professional talking to another and then after the video is over then you can re-go through the material that comes after the video and uh, reinforce it for yourself. Part three, this is where we get into the production related reports. Now I did want to give you one quotable quote. Here it is here from the state of California. It says CPAs must inspect all call sheets and production reports even if filming days were incurred prior to acceptance into the program. Now statements like this are also in Connecticut and um, other states so you need to know what a call sheet is, how effective it can be, production reports, what's the information behind it, things like that. So we cover that effectively. In part four we go over the general ledger software, the structure, the way tagging is used, that is how you tag each individual line to help with the tax credit audit and how you can actually insist that the production accountants do that sort of thing. We also go over the cost report, what it looks like, how it looks and feels, the principles involved, trial balance, things like that. So you have a very good understanding of where you're coming from with that cost report. All right, now I do recommend that you have a look at the how-to video, how to navigate. It tells you how to get the certificate at the end and how the exams work and things like that. And finally, I wanted to point out that uh, on all my courses I have one tag, one uh, line item on the menu bar where you can download all slides from the total course. And in this case, there's like 56 pages. And um, on um, the basic, intermediate, and advanced level, I also have reference links all on one web page so that for your convenience um, and also mine, we have one web page with all the references on one page and I use source as much as possible, that is it goes right to the uh, state of Connecticut, things like that, if, if possible. Alright, thank you very much for taking the time to review this course.